If you have an application or a game on Android that is having issues refreshing the contents of the app after you have minimized it and opened the app back up, then in today's video I'm going to show you how to automate Android to force close that application every time you minimize it and go back to the home screen. So for me personally, I had this issue with a stock application. Whenever I would minimize it and come back to it at a later point, the application sign-in process would log me out. And therefore, I was unable to get updated quotes on the stocks I was looking for because the app didn't think that I was logged in. And it was not directing me to log in again. My solution to fix this was to force close the application each time I wanted to open it up or each time I closed it and minimized it. So I decided I wanted to automate this so that I wouldn't have to deal with it anymore. And in today's video, I'm going to show you how I did that with a free application called MacroDroid. I'll be using this application Longshot as just an example. So as you can see here I can open up the app, go into the settings and minimize, and whenever I go back into that app it keeps me in the settings because the app is still loaded in memory and the app is still running. So after you find an application or game you want to test this on, we're going to download and install the MacroDroid application. And once we're here, we're going to tap on the Add Macro button. And then we're going to tap on the Trigger. So the trigger that we want to set is tucked away in the Applications category. And it's for the application launched slash closed. We want to set this trigger for every time the application is closed. Tap on OK. And then we're going to select the package, tap on OK. And remember, I'm going to be doing this demonstration with an application called Longshot, but you would just pick the application or game from this list that you would want this to be set to. And then it's going to be telling you that accessibility is required here. So we're going to tap on OK. It's going to take us to the accessibility page where we are going to find the Macro Droid application and enable that. Then we're just going to go back, again tap on OK, and then continue on with this macro setup. So with the trigger set we can then tap the plus icon on the actions, and again we're going to be looking in the applications category, and then this time we are going to select the kill application action. Again we're going to be set to the select application option by default so just tap on OK and then scroll down the list to find that same app we're working on. Now if you want we can come up here and name the macro and then we can tap the back arrow to save that macro. So here we have that macro, it is activated, you can tell by the toggle, and we can give it a test. So whenever we open up the long shot application and minimize it, MacroDroid will now kill that application in the background. We can do that again, we can go into the settings area, and now this time when we open up the app again, since it was killed in the background, it will not be in the settings, it'll be in the main page again. So this is the way that I automate killing an application immediately whenever it is minimized. I only do this for apps that have issues refreshing the data after I open them up from being minimized. But you can do this for any application you have on your device as long as you have root access.